It isn't clear yet if a new permit program for rim-to-rim -rim hikes at the Grand Canyon is proving successful. Grand Canyon National Park so far has given out fewer permits than originally expected, only nine for the rest of the year. Now, the permit program was implemented so that the National Park can address overcrowding, litter, and safety issues. So we spoke with Emily Davis with Grand Canyon Public Affairs to find out more. Starting today, went from $25 per vehicle, $30 for a seven-day pass, um, and then the motorcycle entrance fee also increased to $25 for a seven-day pass. The per person fee for anyone entering the park, say on a bicycle or walking in, rose to $15. Increasing the fees for the entrance is to cover things like improvements to the park, for example, roads or visitor centers. Um, that money also goes to help operate the shuttle bus system that we have in the park and other general improvements, um, as well as perhaps habitat restoration and law enforcement and visitor protection as well. The permit program is only a temporary solution to overcrowding as park officials continue to craft a backcountry management plan. A first draft of that plan will be open for public comment in the fall.